Welcome, welcome, and many, many welcomes. I am going to try and finish Subnautica. I am super keen for this game. Super, super, super keen. Um, all right, let's just shut up and have a look at this survival. Crash land on dangerous sailing planet. Scavenge resources to manage hunger, thirst to survive. That one sounds good. Freedom, like survival, about hunger or thirst. Boring, hardcore, permadeath. Ooh, no, 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 no. Creative, boring. All right, survival. Let's do it. Oh, I understand this is a pretty lengthy game too, which is going to be good. We've, uh, yeah, we've sort of breezed through the previous games. But uh, yeah, I was talking to someone, um, Dweeb Gaming, and uh, she was also mentioning Subnautica. So I've had it on my list to do ever since then. That was probably about a month and a half ago, I suppose. But um, yeah, I was trying to get through Green Hell, um, but man, plagued with blue screens. So I truly hope we do not have that problem again. Oh man, the ship looks knocked up. It's definitely been hit by something, hasn't it? Blown an engine out on the right. Maybe shot on the shot on the other side. That's massive too in comparison to that planet, but again, that's far away, isn't it? Who knows? Getting ahead of ourselves, Parry. Oh, sometimes it's a good sign that a game takes so long to load. Other times it's not. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Game face on. Can't find my glasses. I can read that. items, that's what you want. <laughs> I'm loving this start. Absolutely loving this start. Uh, X. Excellent, they're already praising me. Yes! Ooh. Oh, oh shit. You have suffered minor head trauma. This is considered an optimal outcome. Oh, good. The PDA has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive to keep you alive on an alien world. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. Okay. Uh, let me get rid of this. There we go. Uh, okay. So <laughs> Circuitry test failed, secondary systems offline, radio offline, distress signal broadcast failed, flotation devices deployed, hull integrity okay. Well, that's good. Solar power cells one and three. So, oh, we've got a storage container. Oh, nice. Uh, can we, yeah, let's just chuck that in there. Oh, we've got some water and some food. Maybe we should take advantage of these while we're here. Consume. That's better. All right, health is still a little bit funky. Oh, here we go. I think this one. All right, we're back. Health is back. Where the hell are we? <clears throat> um, oh man, damage secondary systems use repair tool. Personal deployables. Uh, resources? No, it'd be a personal equipment tools. Repair tool, silicon rubber, cave sulfur, and titanium. Oh god. Scanner. 
um, spectroscope scanner used to acquire technology, blueprints, and data on living organisms. Flashlight, survival knife, flare, and habitat builder. Um, yep. Use a repair tool. Well. Exit. Ah, um, let's go. Let's go out this way. <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> Flying stingray. Oh man! Oh man! Talk about being lost at sea, eh? Hey? The Aurora suffered orbital hull failure. Cause unknown. Zero human life signs detected. Right, triangle is jump. How nice does this look? Can we run? <laughs> Is this as fast as we go? Break limestone. Copper Ooh. is an essential component of all powered equipment. Your probability of survival has just increased to unlikely. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so O2 is at 18, health, food and water. Where's our thing? Wow, okay, we're gonna have to definitely stay in these shallows. Oh, there's another one of those limestone things. How do we go? Oh, so up and down is L1, L2. It's gonna be weird to get used to. Oh, that was titanium. Okay, so I need to look for these rock things. Titanium. I needed, um, what was the other one? Silicon rubber. Oxygen. Yep, go on, buddy, I'm going. Wait, does X. Must be something else to help me descend. Uh, I don't know. Seems so slow, doesn't it? That's right, we're just starting, we're just starting. Calm down, Parry. Um, oh, uh, food? Can we get it? Uh, went there fast. Gotcha! Creature discovered. Alien life forms may have unexpected applications. Utilizing alien resources is a proven survival strategy. Creature? Ah, oh, shit. Air. Air, Parry. <laughs> oh no, don't die already. Swim! <laughs> Holy crap, we're gonna have to watch out for that. Oh. Oh, man, there's a lot of eggs around, isn't there? Let's get this fella. Um, okay, I'm starting to worry about this, uh, this oxygen already. Takes me a while to get back up, doesn't it? Alright, let's not go too far down, Harry. Um, we got acid mushroom. Do we get to eat them? <laughs> we'll grab three just in case. Uh, more rocks. I wonder if I can catch this fish. Yes! Oh no! Discovered. Got your paper. <laughs> Alright, looks like we just need to grab a heap of stuff, eh, and try and figure out what it is. So we've got, uh, we've got these mushrooms everywhere. Metal. Uh, what else do we have? Another rock. Grab that. Silicon rubber. Couple of rocks there, score. Titanium. Copper. It just seems to be copper and titanium. Let me just have a look here. Yeah, we haven't got anything else. Uh, what 
these things. Table coral. Don't do anything with that. Nothing. Oh. Nothing with that. Uh, grab another one of these. Oh, more rocks. Salt? Could come in handy. Why not? What we got here? Mobile vehicle bay fragment. Oh crap! <laughs> At least nothing's tried to kill me yet. Creep vines. They do look creepy. Oh, they got some fruit. Find C cluster. Am I picking it up though? Oh yeah. New blueprint acquired. Oh jeez, okay, we're, we're filling up, eh? Let's just get back. Let's get back and see if any of the shit will help Life us. Life on this planet grows in unusually distinct and diverse ecological biomes. Further study recommended. Man, it's so nice under here. Isn't it? Past couple of games like I've played have involved water and you've barely been able to see anything, let alone fish. This is unreal. Uh, Alright, let's get to this thing. Ooh, okay, we've opened up heaps of crap. Basic materials. Oh, we got the silicon rubber. That's the creep vine seed. Okay, and it makes lubricant as well. It's handy. I think. <laughs> I don't want my first thing to be <laughs> crash landing. I'm like, oh, let's make some lube. <laughs> I'm just chilling here by myself. Uh, condensed titanium bar. Uh, okay, so... Since it's so close, I might make some lube. <laughs> you never know. Is Jesus, we can make a little lube. And power plants. Uh, electronics. Okay, so we can make a battery and copper wire. That's handy. Oh, did we need a battery for our... Uh, we can make a knife. Okay, let's get that repair tool. Okay, so I need caves so far. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna make a knife. Weapons were removed from standard survival blueprints following the massacre on Abraxis Prime. Oh, the knife yes, let's make one of those two. Exception. The fabricator draws from available data Ooh, to I don't know if that's better or worse. Equipment using locally available Ooh, better, we're going to 75, yes. Safety, this setting cannot be overridden. Uh, what else can we do? Cooked food. Yeah, let's eat those guys up. Water. Okay. Trend is consistent with damage to the Aurora's drive core sustained during planet fall. Ah, oh, I can make like jerky with salt. The fabricator cooks small organisms while disposing of the skeletal structure, oh, hell body yeah. fluids, and internal organs, thus rendering them safe for human consumption. Just want to check out that scanner while I'm there too. Where was that? One battery. Oh, I can build that already. Okay, let's. So acid mushrooms and copper ore. Oh, far out, Harry. This is gonna be um. It's gonna be hard to remember all these fucking rocks and shit. From salvage technology and to record alien biological data. Okay, so it looks like we need some water, so I'll smash that. Food's pretty good at the moment. Um, yeah, let's just try and start filling this up. So I need cave sulfur. I'm just gonna eat that stuff. It. How do we get to our scanner? Perfect. All right, so we need to be in the caves. Gee, she's dark now. If I can just... Ah, oh, 
yeah, let's just scan crazy, eh? Try and figure out some of this stuff. Uh, I said mushrooms. So they're batteries with copper. Uh, let's just see if we can find where are those little caves are in. Here we go. Cave sulfur. Growth patterns indicate colonies direct competition for positions of superior current or light, unlike the coral, the jewel, blah blah, assessment, exporter, in computer chip fabrication. Okay. Not so far. Oh. Coral tube samples are rich in calcium, exploitable in bleach. Oh, we know what that does anyway, don't we? So that makes a titanium. Uh, <clears throat> just trying to look for something different that might make cave sulfur. The hell? Ah! Like our first enemy. Oh, get stuff. <laughs> yes, we have. Oh man, this is so nice, isn't it? Even at night time. So we found a cave sulfur. Um, I think we had everything else. Oh, what's this? Nothing. Uh, oh, titanium. Brain coral. Definitely looks like a brains, doesn't it? Let's see what it does. Air tanks are equipped to siphon oxygen from the water where possible. or something. Yep. Uh, drop. Uh, yeah, let's just... It's pretty big. I don't think we need that right now. Oh, we do need to get some more of these bladder fish though. Especially because our water seems to be going down a lot faster than our food. Don't want to get caught off guard. I think I just grabbed it. Yeah, I grabbed a mushroom, not a bloody not a fish. One more, one more. Oh shit. Um, alright, let's go let's go make that repair tool. Uh, I still wanna scan some stuff too. So that's the table coral, isn't it? Yeah. Oh crap, there's another one of those things. Ah! Should grab his sulfur then. Oh, I wonder where he come from though. Wasn't I just here somewhere? Sounds like it's gonna come in handy. Where old mate come from? Maybe in here. Oh man, it's so. Oh shit! <gasps> man, he's just hammering me. Oh shit, I just noticed my health. Oh, come on, Parry, we can't die already. Shuttlebug. 
Can you like give us a lift to the airport? Oh, was that treasure? Oh, that's the right. Okay. Limestone. Uh, okay, where is our little deployable fella? There it is. Oh yeah, we do seem to be going much quicker. Uh, Alright, we need to do something about our health. Already. Um, okay, so... Is that thing... Oh, yes! Okay, cool. So that thing just keeps making them for us. That's better. Um, okay, so we've got cave sulfur. What else did we need? We needed... Um, Silicone rubber. Repair tool. Yes. Uh, let me make some water. Disinfecting uh, water. Bleach. Ah, that was that um, table coral. CO2 tank, geez, that'd be good, but that's... Silver, haven't even found any of that. And no glass, either. Oh, really? Salt deposit and coral? Coral tube? Oh, it was a table coral or something else. Wait, yeah, I thought it was red. Quartz, salt deposit, and coral tube sample. Okay. I'm trying to remember to offload as much stuff as I can, I think, in this box to. Uh, let's smash that. Cave sulfur, we might put that over there as well. Uh, we'll put some. Actually, yeah, we'll just keep our weapons on us and some. Okay. I really want to suss that bleach out. Um, because that will. Help us out with the water. Giant coral tubes. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that was the yeah, it was the blondie one, so we just need to find some more salt. Oh, I didn't even repair all that shit either. Um, uh, okay, let's get our scanner out. Ah, you know what, we have some salt on board. Let's just Let's just try and make that. We need to repair all that stuff too. Get the sidetrack parry. So what's this thing? Lifeport secondary systems online. Running full environment diagnostic and outputting results to data. Oh, this is better. Okay, second online uh, radios offline. Incoming radio communication online. Okay, so we can receive, but not send any deployed hull integrity. Okay, uncharted ocean planet, oxygen, nitrogen atmosphere. Waterborne bacteria levels are high. Ooh, that's, that can't be good. Oh yeah, let's repair this bad boy. Okay. Uh, let's take that salt. Let's see if we can make some better water. Yep. Bleach is an essential chemical used for cleaning wounds and purifying water. Okay. Preparing 
the day's water ration ahead of time will help ensure against dehydration and eventual death. Yeah, I agree. Oh, so it gives us more water as well. Ah, that is so good. Okay, so let's stash. Stash some water. Oh man, I can see storage is going to be a massive issue here. Um, then we'll just head back in the water. Ah, I'm sort of a little bit lost what to do though. I suppose I just explore, don't I? Okay, let's just have a little... Oh, that's the quartz that makes glass. Yep. Oh, we don't have to. Okay. Alright, let's... Um... Oh, gee, was it too early to work on that extra oxygen tank then? I sort of don't really know what else to do. Except, you know, upgrade ourselves to be better prepared. Uh, so personal equipment. So a standard O2 tank which we can make with titanium. So we have that glass, titanium and silver ore. Okay so we're probably just going to have problems with silver ore then. Well, that uses two quartz for one glass. Okay well that'll free up our space a little bit more. Right, so we need silver. Just thinking most of the fun stuff's gonna be inside these caves, eh? Just have a little sniff around and see what we can find. And the thing is too, you need to find out like oh we need to learn what's dangerous and what's not. Progress is 50%. Alright, so I need to find more of those things. Oh, here's that creep vine. That makes lube. 30 seconds. Edible construction applications. Oh shit. What's this like cut? Telling me to cut the creep vine. New blueprint acquired. Uh, silicon based plant material. Oh, you can eat it. Yum. There you go. Got our own lifeline of spinach here. These guys look a little interesting, don't they? If we can scan one. A little gas mask thing on his face. <laughs> Stay still, mate. Gas pod. <laughs> Looks like a weird super villain. Oh, another bit of quartz, why not? Oh, crap. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, Jesus, man. Continued degradation of the Aurora's drive core may result in a quantum detonation. Continuing to monitor. I think she just said something's going to detonate. Okay, we don't need any food. Just need to find some more stuff. Oh, here we go. What's this? Coral shell plate. No practical applications discovered. Awesome. That's one one thing to uh, take off our little list then, eh? Oh, he's one of those little eggs. Oh, okay, you can just pick him up. Right, if you could eat them. Okay, we need silver. Uh... Oh, 
Come on, man. Serious? Why? Ah, oh, crap. There it was. I'm just gonna grab that sulfur. Alright, let's go up and get some air and then we'll, um... I think we'll drop down here and have a little look. It seems to be all same, same around the pod. you think silver would stand out, wouldn't you? Collect some more of these bad boys, too. Copper. What's this? Another egg. It's a bit creepy near the creep vines. This happy fellow. Oh, jeez, I was going to say, look at this happy fellow. Not happy. Still following me? No. He looks like he'd pack uh, way more of a punch than the um, than those little sulfur things. Yes. Habitats are an essential component of many habitat modules. Thirty seconds. Oh no, I'm getting there, man. I'm getting there. All right. Jesus. Uh, okay, I think I think we only needed one silver, so that's good. So we'll grab one of those, but we don't need one of those, do we? Okay, so that's a normal one. Copper, we'll still fill up on those, just in case. Oh gee, actually, you know what? Our storage is almost bloody full, isn't it? Alright, let's head up. Oh jeez, we're deep. Seconds. Yep. Geez, the night and the days are pretty uh, quick, aren't they? Okay, I'm just going to check this this wall here. So we want to find some of the little red ones. Hopefully we just needed one. It's fabricator. What are we doing? So I need one more glass. Ah, oh, it is only one. Okay, that's good at least. So make some titanium. Find 
some more quartz. Let's see, they were in a in a tunnely thing, weren't they? Try here. Yep, this is it. Perfect. Just grab a couple more of these, hey, just in case. It's a normal one. Does someone want to scan something there? Fane's needle? Common shallow plant which frequently shows signs of predation around the edges of the leaves. Thick violet veins carry nutrients to the extremities of the fan and brightly coloured seeds grow around the base of the stem. So it's a flower. Well, there's a peeper. <laughs> Look at those things. Oh jeez, air parry, air. I know, I know, I know, I know. Oh, don't drown, don't drown, don't drown. See, we're trying to work on this. <laughs> oh. Yeah, we'll get some food. Gotcha. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> So glass. Uh, can we make it now? Standard. No two ten. Isn't that what I have on me though? Um, yeah, there it is. There. Yes, here we go. High capacity. Alright, so we're we'll always 75 before. Oh, 135. Gee, I do like that. We've got the fins. First aid kit is fibre mesh. Ingredients unknown, that's right, we're only halfway there, aren't we? Okay. Oh, blinky blinky. Receiving pre recorded distress call laying back. This is Life Pod 3, uploading our coordinates. We're plugging some holes in our emergency sea glide, so if we're late for the rendezvous, don't panic. Also, don't go home without us. Seriously. Three out. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Okay, life pod three. Alright, it's in the shallows. Let's go there. If they got a sea glide, I want one. Um I didn't need these guys, did I? Alright, let's We don't want to go hungry. Uh, food. Fish jerky. Cooks butter fish. Cured. Okay. Just keep that in there and see how long it lasts. Alright. Let's just do a um, explore on our way. Sea glide is definitely going to get us there a lot faster, I betcha. I actually bought one of those in, in real life, like legit, when they first come out. They were unreal. They were pretty heavy then, too. I betcha they're a lot lighter now. I think it had like. It wasn't a car battery, but it was freaking huge. All oh, these guys. Okay, they're definitely predators. We had one chase us before. They're like, they're like the sharks. Oh, 
Oh man, this tank is so much better. Oh, what's this? Mobile vehicle bay. One of three. Alright, looks like we need to keep an eye out for... for those boxes. And I want one more of those red things too. Where did our um... Oh, she's there it is. I'm continuously hitting the run button. <laughs> it's not... It's not speeding us up at all. Let's get a bit of air. Perfect. Oh yeah, now. Oh, that's good. We can... This is where the first red thing come from. Oh, there's, there's one there. Is that one? Yep, perfect. Alright. Oh, that was something else too. Alright, these things definitely hang out with the creep vines. I'm gonna keep losing now. Glad we're not relying on a um on a compass. Let's hope we can hide everything. Should grab some salt, we'll grab a bit of salt, why not? Oh yes, there we go. Um, I thought that was something good. Oh, here's another thing. Oh, sea fragment. I think we only need one more of those. Yes, we can make a sea glide. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, oh, there's our little. Wait, no, that's us. All right, let's go back that way. Let's get some air. Alright, I wonder what the hell we need to make our... Oh, there it is there. Our sea glide. I was going to say, that's pretty close really, isn't it? Okay. Sea glide. Okay, we just got titanium. Here we get it in this thing. Holy shit! Ooh, they... that... Looks like an internal fart gone wrong, doesn't it? Integrating new PDA. You really think it'll carry two of us? Your regular sea glide tows a mass of 80 kilograms at over 30 kilometers an hour. The power seller rigged with this one should double that. You think there's something out there that's faster? Oh, sure. And that's assuming it doesn't overload three meters from the light mod. You're calm about this. I'm seeing the engineering problem. If I stop seeing the mats... I'll be terrified. New blueprint acquired. Um, so that sucks. I was just talking about a compass and then that's what we unlocked. Oh, hang on. Did we get this one? Oh, shit. My old vehicle bay, no. Let's grab it. Ah. Two or three. Oh. Sharks want us dead. What if we can scan one? Hey, buddy. Uh, uh, oh, jeez, oh, that was a big hit, too. Stalker. <laughs> I thought if I just stay in front of his head, I'll be fine. Looks like he can just lean back. <laughs> Yeah, let's just go get our sea light. Let's work towards that. Uh, I think we need to do a bit of reading too when we get back in this little pod, nice and safe. Uh, oh, let's just have a little drink. And what's this thing doing? Still cured. Oh shit. For warning, local radiation readings suggest the Aurora Drive Core has reached critical state. Quantum detonation will occur within two hours. Oh, that does not sound good. Wait, so this thing's gonna blow up? Ah. Oh. Like, how far away am I from it? It looks really close. Two hours. I'm not too sure about that day. Night seems to go so quickly. Uh, 
if this thing survived that exploding, I think we'll we'll try and be in here when that happens, just in case. Oh, lead. Okay, that's what we got. Quartz we know about, salt we know about, gold, conductive properties, and silver, of course. Okay, cool. Um, let's see how we make that sea glide. Deploy. Yep. Battery, lubricant, copy, copper wire, and titanium. Well, we've uh, we can make a battery with mushrooms. We already have lube and copper wire. No. Two copper. Ore. Crap, we can actually make one. I think. So two copper ore, one lube, and a battery, which was, I think, two of these? So, battery. Ah, uh, okay. Ah, uh, so a battery, right, that was two and a... And a bit of copper. Right. Uh, I think that was it. Yes! The Sea Glide will increase your effective exploration range. For your safety, please pack supplies for long journeys and stay within five kilometers of the nearest life pod or habitat. Okay, I, th I think I just want to go. Obviously, play with this. Oh, that could be handy. A little light. Yes. So we've got a light and a map. Or, ah, uh, okay, so it's either both or one. Alright, I think we'll just stick with the light for now. Um, Alright, I need I need to get some food. I'm a little bit concerned about food and water, so we need to get some more salt. Uh, where are those creep vines? Creep vines, creep vines, creep vines. This way, maybe? Yep. So we get some air. Oh, this is so much faster. Oh yeah, we should be able to outrun things now. Okay, so we need some salt and we'll get some food on the way too. Be able to catch these little bastards now. Ooh. Okay, maybe not. They're quick, aren't they? <laughs> How'd they go? <laughs> Wait! Peeper! Gotcha! Oh, come on, mate. Come on, come on. Harry's hungry. There we go, that's an egg. Bladder fish. Oh, what's this thing? Oh, man. Oh, salt. We do need salt. Uh, yummy. Fish. New creature discovered. <laughs> I'm just grabbing everything. I'm hungry. <laughs> Come here. Nope, nope. Uh, oh, man, this is... Like, I don't know if this is easier or harder with this thing. Alright, let's... Um, Alright, salt. Get back in the game, Parry. Gold. Oh, shit. Uh, more salt. Hello, salt. Oh, gee, was that a stalker? Yep. Like a, was that a baby stalker? Uh, not sure. some salt hiding. Alright, let's get back to our little life pod. Oh man, I love this sea glide. We're exploring so much easier now. Yeah, definitely just food and water. Keep our health up. Oh, oh man, this thing is not looking good, is it? That's right, it's going to blow up soon. Um, okay, 
so let's do some cooking and then we'll just do a little bit of reading. Uh, okay, so I need... Oh, that's right, I need the bleach stuff. Table coral. That's that stuff there. Which I should grab. And then we'll see what it... That's right, we need bleach. So that makes one. And one bleach makes two drinks. And I've... Oh, salt I have. A lot of salt. Alright, let's just go get at least a couple more of those pieces of this which was just here. Was your favorite activity. Be sure to vary your routine for uniform muscle development. Oh, yeah, yeah, let's, let's, start, let's start running. Some battery power cells, two batteries, one silicon, computers, holy shit, wiring kits, cook food. Oh, this is that compass thing. Displace compass heading on the HUD. Copper wire and wiring kit. Wiring kit. It's two silver ore. Okay, I don't think we've got that anyway. Fins. It's a rebreather. Conserves oxygen when diving deeper, absorbs and recycles CO2 into breathable air. Oh, that sounds bloody handy. Floating air pump. Floating device that pumps air into pipes. Acts as a starting point for a pipe gen. No, I'm not really into that. Dragon shit all around with me. Tools. Pathfinder tool deploys holographic pathfinder discs used to map a way back out of caves or hard to navigate spaces. Okay, that sounds somewhat handy, I guess. See, glad we got. Okay, we need one more of those. Base. Multi purpose room. Hatch window. So solar panels? Base attached air pump. Fabricate a nice wall lockers, lockers, aquarium, aquarium. Oh, that'd be nice. A sign. Okay, what else do we have here? Life pod. Okay. Oh, did we take a picture? Did we? <laughs> All right. I suppose I was button smashing pretty hard. We see. Okay, we heard that the sea glide warning local radiation. Yeah, what happened to these guys? I'm seeing pretty good nice, uh, playing back life, but... Emergency, a quantum detonation has occurred in Aurora's... Ooh. Emergency, a quantum detonation has occurred in the Aurora's drive core. The reactor will reach a supercritical state in T-10, 9, Oh, Jesus. 8, 7, I still don't want to watch it. 5, 4, I may regret 3, this. 
sleep. Radiation? We acquired. For your convenience, the radiation suit has been added to your blueprint database. Nice. Uh okay, this thing's going blinky blinky again. This is Ozzy from the cafeteria. What the hell, guys? <laughs> they didn't want us this might happen. Our pod was almost crushed by the Seamoth Bay on the way down. Now we're hanging on the edge of a cave system, and this grim-looking snake thing's trying to eat through the hull. Come get us already. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Uh, where? Oh, he's a little bit further away. All right, let's go. Screw it. Let's go find Ozzy. Oh, power, 78%. for that as well. We're coming, Ozzy! Oh yeah, we're making some good time. Oh, Jesus. Oh, this is different. Oh, he's going for that fish. Did he get it? Yep. <laughs> yum yum. Good catch, buddy. Better job than I do. Holy shit. Alright, let's... Uh, just get some air real quick. Crap, look at that thing. It's massive. Alright, let's go, Ozzy. Oh no, Ozzy shagged as well. Oh man, oh jeez, this light works really well. Ozzy's vlog. It's the day of the crash. I don't know what the heck is happening. I'm scared and I'm not going outside. There are shadows in the water under the hatch, but I can't tell if they're rocks or aliens. And there's weird looking caves nearby. The Aurora was carrying everything needed to build the phase gate. Mobile vehicle bays, bioreactors, propulsion cannons. It had a cinema. There, there was a zero G gym. My cafe. I don't understand how we're here now. I don't know why no one's coming for me. Freaking seam off. Now we're bloody talking. Um. Right, so Ozzy was by himself too. Um, Passing 100 meters, oxygen efficiency decreased. But it looks like Ozzy's dead. Uh, I didn't find one of those data things here though. Maybe they just don't all have them. Oh, hang on. What's this? Oh, there's an, another thing over there. Seamoth, Ozzy. Seamoth. Laser cutter. 30 seconds. That's right. We're okay. Local scans show a nearby cave entrance. Depth 90 meters. Leading oh, to an unknown up. environmental biome. 61%. Just keep an eye on that, uh, that battery power. I suppose I'm cranking the torch, aren't I? Okay, let's go find out what that other thing is. I've seen a massive pile of salt too, we better check that out. Uh, that's the one I just scanned. There's the other one there. The fuck. Scanner. Yeah. Laser cutter? Yep. Salt. Oh, there's another red thing over there. We'll grab that. 
special equipment is required to collect this resource. Like a knife. Oh, did that work? Am um, I getting salt? I think we're getting salt. So there's three pieces there. Old, oh, okay. Are the cuits still good to go? Oh, I'm dropping it, you idiot. <laughs> X. Okay, so that's. I think I just lost my corpse one. Oh, there it is. It's old. It's okay, we'll still eat it. Looks like Aussie is shagged. Oh jeez, where does that go? Alright, let's get some air and have a look. Seconds. Are these weird things? Alright, 54%. I think we better grab some of those um, acid mushrooms on the way back and make another battery. Definitely worth it though. Maybe later we can make better batteries that last longer, who knows. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Oh, they're different. Red wart. That's definitely for spells, for sure. It's like some weird cauldron thing. Oh, what is this? Conditions in this cave support a microcosm of unique, possibly predatory life forms. Detecting an artificial structure somewhere in the region. Holy dooly, man. Holy crap. 30 seconds. Ah, uh, that is massive. Man, that is so deep as well. That must be what we need that sea glide for. Oxygen. Let's see how far we can get without dying. That's too curious not to look at. Yep, don't even collect anything, Barry. Let's just suss it. That is massive. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. Is that something? What the hell? There's things down here? Oh, man. Oh, shit. Where's it? There it is. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to go down there and scan them. We'll, we'll just have to come back here. Yeah, my power's running low. Yeah, it's, it's not. It's a recipe for disaster. Let's just head back to our life pod. Or is our life pod that way? Man, I like this um this biome though. Like it's a lot cleaner, isn't it? Like in respect to you can see things a lot easier. Lose my life putting it. There it is. Yeah, man, this place is nice. Look, look how dingy and green the, this one is that we're in. The slime biome. Oh, I think I've been to this one. Mobile vehicle. Wait, maybe I haven't. I've looked at it plenty of times. 
Oh, we can. Oh, jeez, we can make it now. Okay. We definitely need that for the sea moth. Uh, but we can't make the sea moth yet, can we? No. Well, at least I finally got a mission. Like, I want to check out that cave system. That is sick. Oh, there's another one of those uh, explodey things. Oh, I wonder if I can outrun it now. Let's just test it. What is it not on? I thought it was one of those um, cave sulfur things that want to blow up on you. There's one. Let's go, buddy. Yes! <sighs> Finally outrun the little shits. scary I can so see me friggin run out of air getting lost in a cave um, okay oh we got another message already this is Avery Quinn of trading ship Sunbeam Aurora do you read over nothing but vacuum these Altera ships they run low on engine grease they send an SOS you offer to help they don't pick up Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. It's going to take more than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Over. Yes. I'll try them again tomorrow. Damn charter's going to have us blowing our credits running errands for Altera. See what the long-range scans pick up in the meantime. Uh, okay, I need to make some fiber mesh. Um, creep vine sample by two. Okay, I want to make that rebreather and see if it helps us a little bit. Um, so, let's go get some creep creepers. Oh, we need to get some more batteries too. Oh, they're just here. Sweet. I'm sure we've got enough bloody copper. Um, so the creep vines are here. Grab two of them. Two of them, I think it was, yeah. Bit of slicey dicey action. That's not too shabby, we just need to prepare for that. Uh, you're not even that quick anymore. <laughs> Look at me, I'm like a fucking dolphin. <laughs> Starting to get the hang of this. Uh, Rebreather. Okay, so is that on me now? Yes. Okay, so conserves oxygen when diving deeper, absorbs and recycles CO2 into breathable air. Sweet. Okay, let's make a battery. Cave the rebreather. Okay, so how do I square? Sweet. Okay. Just dropping shit in the ocean, though. It's like a trash bin or something. Uh, maybe it's biodegradable. <laughs> uh, okay, so we need to find that. Oh no, let's just suss out our oxygen here. Let's see what it does. Without rebreather. Actually, old mate was this way, wasn't he? Yeah, we'll, we'll go back to the, we'll make our way back to that um, red biome. Just suss it out. Just... 
new creatures Hold discovered. Fish. I mean, most of the names make sense at least, eh? Like, who names them though? Is a scanner like just name and all? Like, how does it know what these alien species are called? Um, oh, feels like we're close. Yep. Red. Hell yeah. Let's suss this out a little bit. There's one of those things. Let's see if we can scan it once. Is it stuck? Oh shit, it's not stuck. Nope, 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 nope. Oh yeah. Definitely Predator. Oh, look at him. Bet you this is called a chompy. What's a sand shark? Funny feeling a chompy would have been way better. Rebreather then didn't really do too much, did it? Okay, so. Oh man, look at that thing. That thing is beyond repairable now. What do we got down here? Oh, wait, is this our cave? Yes, this is our cave. down to that stash of stuff. Where was it? So close to the entry. There it is. Oh god, this is risky, Parry. Oh man, look at those big ass worms too. What? Yes, here we go. What have we got here? Abandoned PDA. Oh no, is there no goods in here? Wait, what's up? Floodlights? Where was the exit? <laughs> oh, this way. <laughs> ah, crap. See what I mean? We're definitely going to drown in a cave. Can we go a little bit quicker, please? <laughs> oh, yes. We're out. We're out. Um, okay, what did I get? Things happen so fast, don't they? Let's go back to base and just try and figure some of this stuff out. Because I really don't know what I'm doing. I mean, the radio is flashing and I go there and everyone's dead. I suppose we just need to get off this rock, don't we? Surely that'll be the mission. The goal. Radiation suit. Okay, that's that's what we learned when the thing blew up. Floodlight. We just learned that. Um, vehicles. We know data downloads. That's the one we wanted. Is it no? Is it Degassi survivors? Don't know what that is. Data downloads. Degassi. Environment log. User poor toggle requested cross-referencing of local environment scans while the habitat construction conditions display and results. Large subterranean cavern with multiple entrances conditions support. You. Okay, so this is the thing that we just got inside that cave. Predatory life forms, minor structural instability, cave walls, extensive res resource deposits, average environment safety C, optimal hab habitat site safety rating B. 
Site 7 has been selected as optimal habitat for construction site for the following reasons, close proximity to one of the cave entrances in case of emergency, which is the one we come in and went in. Um, medium distance from predatorial orga organisms, stable foundations, ready access to materials. A signal tracking to site has been created. Okay, so these survivors, they got seven sites? Okay, so they're just scans. I don't think we need to worry about them. Hang on. Analysis confirms this wreckage is from the aurora outer layers and the material of oxidized, suggesting it has been heated to over 1200 Celsius. This pattern is consistent with the whole disintegration during the atmospheric entry. Okay, so the sandstone, titanium. God, there's so much here. Okay, I do like that we can go back and read shit if we need to. Okay, so that's interesting. So there's Aurora survivors, which is us, and then these Degassi survivors. I guess we're going to learn more about us and them. And that's just all the other stuff that we scanned. All right, sweet. All right, we're getting the hang of this. We're getting the hang of this. Um, and this guy's going to contact us again when he does some freaking loop around the atmosphere or something. Let's chow down. Let's get some food into us. Okay, we're going to eat a hopper fish. Nom nom. Disguising the flavor of unsavory meat with salt or locally sourced herbs and spices. Drink your purse. Lithium? Lead. Do we have. I don't think we had lithium before. Uh, no, we didn't. Okay. Might just take another one of these waters. Let's see, I'll put this lithium over here. And I wish this stuff would stack. It should stack, shouldn't it? Uh, okay, sweet. Let's see what uh, see what's going on here then. Aurora, this is Sunbeam again. Mm. We just picked up a massive debris field at your location. I didn't know how bad, how many of you. Oh, it's bad. Know. We're now en route to your location. We're gonna bring you home. Sunbeam out. What else can I say? The only time I parked a rig this big on a rock that small was in VR. <laughs> and I blew it. It's a bad option, all right, but so are all the others. I think you forgot to end communication, mate. <laughs> oh, we got totally faith, total faith in you now. Let's grab one of those. I think we want to, oh no, we got no room in storage, do we? Alright, so we just need to wait for these little things to come through. And we need a Seamoth. Let's just go to that Seamoth section again. Was that down here? Yep, should have been down here somewhere. Ah, oh, there it is. One of three. Okay, so we need to find more Seamoth bitses. Oh, laser cutter, we haven't learned that. Propulsion cannon? That sounds like fun. Wow, man, this game is going to be a lot, hey, like a lot, bioreactor, and we're just learning shit constantly. Uh, proposed a grassy habitat, that's interesting too. Oh, I can change the colours? Oh, that's good. Um, I'm going to make these guys red and make us blue. I think I like that better just to try and separate both their stories so I don't get confused. Um, man, this has been sort of good, to be honest. Uh, confusing as hell. There's another flying stingray. Uh, can you come after these guys? The hell? Oh, am I getting them? 
Oh, no, they doubted it or gone. Not sure. I think we might call it here. This is just like, ugh. I'm going to have to um, try and get my head around all this crap. Otherwise, I'm going to spend most of the time just scratching my head wondering what the fuck I'm doing. Oh, okay, so yeah, and we need to go back there, don't we? So it's 250 metres deep, 564 metres away. Alright, we're going to need that seam off. Episode 2, we're going to have to find and somehow create that seam off. There's no way in the world we can stay down there otherwise. Um, and I don't even know if we do anything with this thing. Who knows? Anyway, Episode 1, done! Subnautica, baby! Doodles!